successful business here, successful entrepreneurship is about what? Keep your heart out of it, streamline. It's what Jay-Z says, I dumbed down my lyrics and doubled my sales. Dumb it down to sell more. Dumb it down to sell more. That's the lesson there. Dumb it down to sell more. Is that selling out? Yes, I would say, unless, I mean, because, you know, it's also the role of a poet to streamline ideas, right? It's not, you know, streamlining is not dumbing down. There's a difference, right? The streamlining that a poet does would be taking the essence of an idea, the essence of another idea, the essence of another idea, and, and bridging those things together, but getting rid of all the unnecessary fat in terms of wordage, you know? So it, it ends up being something really impactful. And things haven't always had to be dumbed down in order to, to reach large groups of people. I mean, you can look at Jimi Hendrix or you can look at Star Wars, you know what I'm saying? Like, we're capable of taking in a lot. Um, me, I'm frustrated by any executive or anyone who tries to, who, who essentially underestimates the intelligence of the listener or of the audience, as opposed to feeding the intelligence. Because what it does is it warps our idea even of what entertainment is or what it's supposed to be. You know, like I come from theater. Theater is something that is very seldom dumbed down because it reflects life. In the same way that life is not dumbed down, life is what it is. It has those same complexities. And you walk out of a play like, holy shit, that was crazy. I felt like that moment was odd. Did you hear how the, and when they said that, oh my God, it was just like my life and da 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 da. When's the last time you walk away from a song or an album like that? You know? So whether there are corporate executives, you know, that, that, would like to see us dumb or keep things simple or tell us that we need something that, you know, that we can't live without. I mean, there's many ways of doing business, you know, like you look at uh, Steve Jobs' Apple moment. Had very little to do with dumbing down. Definitely had a lot to do with streamlining ideas, but there was no dumb down and it really upgraded awareness and consciousness and our ability to connect and, and, and be connected. I would like to think that more artists realize their value so that they realize that they are so much more than just a businessman, so much more than just a businessman, that they're an emissary of a greater good. Yeah, we need to eat and all this other stuff, but, but art represents something really special in society. And the artists that, that we list, when we list the greats, are pretty much always the ones who realize that, who realize that they symbolize something greater than just good business. I mean, you look at Michael Jackson, for example, who sold a lot of albums and, and touched a lot of people. But it's, it's impossible for any one of us to not know that that dude sang from his heart, that he had a huge love for humanity and, and that when he said something like heal the world, like he was really going for that. Like he really wanted to heal the world through music if he could. You can feel that in the music, like holy shit. It's more than just like being at the fresh club with the freshest clothes, the freshest girl and the freshest car. So it's really just about, you know, in that sense, I think it's about artists realizing their value how much of a privilege it is to even be recognized as an artist and to take it to another level in order to compete with the greats, not to compete with the number of albums they sold simply, but to compete with the number of hearts that they touched and how deeply they touched them. And we're talking about high school and grade school. This is a pivotal time. This is an impressionable time, especially a time where you should be using your creativity and figuring out how to use your creativity along with book smarts. The father comes up from the back like this and starts like charging Ray and start boxing him. Boom. <laughs> like, oh shit, Ray's ex getting beat up by a kangaroo. Keep hip hop strong and, 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 and keep it going and put music, uh, good music back out there to the community. Like, my, my career isn't comprised of Kanye West or Common only. Blue Collar, whatever we're talking about with J Records, Blue Collar was a classic album. 